no sickness. Me and the affliction of the righteous and the Lord shall deliver them out of harm. Don't get in the place with me. Hear me? Hey, I'm talking about spiritual sickness. Hey, y'all. And you've been there too long. You've been there too long. The ER is for you to pass through, get what you need, and go not the door. You ain't got to admit it in this sickness. Long term care. You done did long term care. Now you got to go back for another 30 days. My God, follow me in the Holy Ghost. The ER, it's okay if I go through a little something, but I'm supposed to go through that ER, get my prescription, and get on back to the house. But we lay it down with the devil. We adjure you by Jesus who Paul preaches. Go to 14. Whew, my God. And there were seven sons of Sceva, Sceva, however you say that, a Jew and chief of the priests, which did so. And the evil spirit, the what? Evil spirit. The what? The evil spirit. The what? Evil spirit. The evil spirit did what? You keep it up, you're going to be having a regular conversation and that spirit going to speak out of you and tell what it is. Yeah. He going to tell it. He going to tell it. My God. I told Pepper last night when we was in sin, we were saying when somebody talking smack about us, we say, you better keep my name out of your mouth. You ever heard somebody say that? That's, how, that's your defense. You better keep my name out of your mouth. Right? You better keep God's name out of your mouth. You better stop using that name when you don't have consent. Amen. Jesus. I remember that you read it for both. Somebody said something about you. You, be you better keep my name out of your mouth. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, help us, God. Woo. My God. Woo. Let me get out of y'all way. Woo. Y'all cutting up in here tonight. Ooh. Don't act like y'all been saved all your life. You know you've been out here ready to scrap pro blows. People ain't got to say too much. You ready to throw down. Put it on my shoulder and knock it off and see who's going to go first. Now, my God, you don't want to help me in here tonight. Ain't like they've been at church since 1989. Like they were born with the Holy Ghost. You know y'all did that. Put that piece on there and start scrapping. Help us, God. We don't supposed to be like that in faith. See, who gonna knock it out first, huh? Who? Who? You can't. Get that. Put a cast on your neck. Get that snake out of your neck. Who? Help us, God. Who? Oh, good. Help us, God. Y'all know. If you got a sassy devil, just ask the Lord to help you. I just made it come. I got good. I got good. He'll make it come before you can repent. Help me, Lord. Mom, everybody laugh at Jesus. Help me, God. Y'all ain't going to have love, Lord. Man. Oh, my God. All right, let me get on out here. Woo. Man. And the man in whom the evil spirit was leaped upon. Let me go back, child 15. And the evil spirit answered and said, What? Jesus, I know. And Paul, I know. But who are you? Jesus. Look, y'all gonna stop playing, getting up here. Got to call the minister to come for And you out here playing? <laughs> Jesus. Help me, God. We can't be playing out here. Uh -uh. These devils is real. These devils is real. They real. And they come up here to get delivered. And you need to be what? Delivered. You don't want that devil to start talking and tell everybody how you live. Oh my God, help us God. Help us mighty God. Jesus I know. Paul I know. Wait a minute. They say some people like to 
you're supposed to pray for them. Well, guess what? The devil know too. Help us, God. That spirit spoke out. Jesus, I know. Paul, I know. But who are ye? And the man in whom the evil spirit was leaped on them. Ha! He jumped on them. Oh, y'all making the church scared. I'm going to get so scared they repent. Who am I, y'all? 